Hi everyone, I wanted to share this 12 by 12 hybrid um, scrapbook layout that I created. Um, for some of you that don't know what hybrid um, scrapbooking means, it's just a form of digital scrapbooking combined with regular scrapbooking. Um, because in digital scrapbooking, you wouldn't need to use any stickers or any embellishments. You would create that all on the computer. Um, but this is a combination of both. And I really love the way that it turned out. This um, page has a lot of meaning to it. Um, it's, it expresses how I feel about my boyfriend and how he makes me feel and my love for him. Um, because behind all my work and my artwork, there is meaning behind it. It's, it's my way of expressing myself um, through my artwork, if that makes any sense. And... I really, really love the way that it turned out. So I'm calling this um, layout a bullet full of love. And I always tell my boyfriend that he shot me with a bullet full of love. And obviously I don't know what it feels like to get shot, but I assume that, you know, whoever, you know, if you feel it all over your body, if you do, and it's what he's, you know, made me feel. It's what he's made me feel all over. And what he's, some of the things that I've learned from him. Um, he's, you know, he's given me true love. He's, you know, given me strength. He's taught me patience. He's given me a friendship like no other. Uh, most importantly, he's, um... He reminds me to love myself, to never forget to love myself. And I really love the way that it turned out. And the reason why I wanted kind of to explain what hybrid scrapbooking is, is because this is not any paper that you could purchase at the store. It's a 12 by 12 um, layout that I created on my own using a couple of photo Photoshop brushes that I have. Actually, the gun one, it's, I googled a picture of a gun on the computer, and then I made a brush out of it on Photoshop. And then with the, um, I have some decorative brushes, and then I have some grunge brushes, some ink brushes, and some florist brushes. I have a, a lot of different ones on, on Photoshop. So that's how I was able to create the whole page on my own. And I really love the way that it came out. I printed it out on 140-pound watercolor paper. And luckily, I have a printer that prints up, prints out up to 13 by 19, I believe. So if you want to see what this page originally looked like before I altered it or put any stickers or anything on it, um, head to my blog, craftynina.blogspot.com. And I will post a link down below. And then you can also find a link on the sidebar of my channel. And you can see what it completely looks like before I put before I put a hole in the heart and before I actually added the bullet. And the bullet was a charm that I found at the dollar store. I added some glossy accents, some alcohol ink, some stickers, um, some wire, wire material that I had. Um, this sticker is from the color book um, flea market. I believe, and so is the transparency. I actually printed this picture out of me and my boyfriend, and then I put some of that wire material behind there, put some stickers. I added um, stickers all around, and I also added some Distress Crackle paint in the color black suit all around the layout. And this is some trim that I had. This is what the trim looks like. Oops, there you go. And I added that trim on the side. Stickers, that's a rub on. That's a rub on. And that's a rub on. And then that's a word that I printed it on. That's just patience as I printed out on my computer. And then that one, true love, is just some stickers. And I love this picture of my boyfriend's back because I always tell him that I love the way his back looks. So I shot this picture of him a while back. 
so I incorporated this picture in the digital um, layout you know that I that I in the whole paper that I created I added his picture and not this one this is actually printed out and cut out and then glued on so I hope you guys um, get a chance to head over to my blog so you guys can really see what you know what I created and what it originally looks like and I really love the way that it turned out I love my boyfriend me and him have a very good relationship and I don't think I've ever experienced love the way that I have with him so this is you know this this layout means a lot to me and I just didn't I wanted to make a layout that it, you know that really expressed the way he really makes me feel you know I could have made like you know a real pretty layout with a heart and picture of us and stuff but I wanted to really be able to express myself and and really create something and I just love the way that it turned out and then I what I did I had said that I was gonna make something for me and him so I made um, wearable art for him and this is just what you know how he makes me feel and I ended up um, shrinking down the layout printed it out one printed it out I believe it's um it's one and a half inch by one and a half inch and put it between memory glass and I had put some copper foil tape around it and you know I added some flux and you know with my with my um with my tool that I have to put it together and I had this heart charm and I actually put some alcohol ink over it I put some distressing a distress paint um, and then alcohol ink and this is another bullet charm that I added on there and I really love the way that it turned out I'm definitely gonna wear this necklace and then I'm gonna make it into a keychain for my boyfriend or he said he'd put it um you know um, he'd said he, he said he'd wear it too but I don't know we'll see I'm definitely gonna wear it before I actually give it to him he actually wants the layout, but I want to keep the layout, so I don't know. We'll see. I'll probably make him another one. I love the way the necklace turned out, and I have all this material. Um, so I had to dig through my stash, because I used to make some of these necklaces before. So, and then all you do is, you know, get the memory glass, put the copper foil tape, and then um, you need some flux and some lead some lead free um, what is it solder solder I believe that's what it's called and then obviously you would need one of these tools but it's pretty easy to you know to put this necklace together was pretty easy but I really love the way that it turned out and I also have pictures on my blog So if you guys have any questions, or oh, I actually put some butterflies on there too. I I actually um, punched it out on one of the transparencies, transparencies, transparencies that came with the um, the flea market collection that I have. I actually wrote some stuff um, behind this, and you can't really see it, but I did write some stuff what my heart felt like before you know my boyfriend came in my life and how then after he shot me <laughs> he he made me feel a lot more he made me feel you know something I've never felt before can you tell I'm totally in love I've been with him for four years and we are just it's like it's I don't know it's like love at first sight every day <laughs> So anyhow, if you guys have any questions, please feel free to leave it in the comments below. Um, please check out my blog so you guys can see the actual before and after. You know, obviously, this is the after, but the before. Um, thanks for um, your comments. And I just checked my channel today, so I'm super excited. I'm at 101 subscribers, and I um, told myself that if I reached 100 subscribers, I was going to have a giveaway. So stay tuned for the giveaway. I'm going to put some goodies together. And... Um, 
and hopefully put up the video this weekend. Alright everybody, thanks for watching. Bye.